Hey everyone, I'm going to make another video about the rehab estimate sheet. Whenever you're trying to figure out how to estimate expenses, you need to know how old the items are and not necessarily just how old they are, but how old they were and if they were permitted so that you can actually put them uh, on your insurance and your appraisal to help help you get the correct value for the house. So things like your big expenses, the roof, air, roof, air conditioner, hot water heater, plumbing, electrical, your big ticket items are what you're most interested in. I found this random house on Zillow here, and it is in Jacksonville, Florida, which is Duval County. So I can look at the building inspection division for Duval County, um, which is buildinginspections.coj.net. I punch in the address here, hit go, and it pulls up all the permits for this property. As we can see, this is a R permit. That's going to be a roof, an E permit. That's electrical. P permit, that's plumbing. So it looks like we've got a roofing permit from 2009, electrical permit from 2001, and a plumbing permit from 2001. We'll click on the, the R1 here to see what it says. You can kind of scroll through, click through these items, give you an overview of the project. It was a re-roof, $6,700. So we can be very confident that this roof was most recently done in 2009, which would put our current roof age at 14 years old. Most roofs last 25 to 30 years. This is going to be a great roof that's going to have a lot of life left in it. Going back to the list, we can look at this electrical permit. Uh, a real company did it. We can go to overview. Uh, it's going to be a reground, $0 repair. So I do not feel confident that this was a complete rewire or a panel upgrade just based on the lack of information here. We'll click on the plumbing permit. And the plumbing permit... Not a lot of information here from 2001. Um, so this says it might have been a repipe. So this will kind of be a question mark. Even if this was a repipe done 22 years ago, you're not confident about what may or may not have been done. So you're going to need to follow up uh, to be more exact on what this might look like. But this is a quick way to kind of look up, look up permits and see uh, what things might have been done on a property. We can do another one here. This was a previous house that we did, that we flipped, 850 Leafy Lane. This is a property that we flipped in Jacksonville, Florida, and you can see all of our permits here. So this one here is for the a building inspection for the windows and doors, plumbing for a complete repipe, electrical for an, a complete electrical panel upgrade, everything, another building permit for a little bit of framing, and then our roofing permit. So we can click on each of these items. We can look at the, the re-roof. There's the job cost. So we know that's a good roof. Uh, we can look at the plumbing. We know this was a full plumbing job, a full repipe, replace the drains. We can pull up the electrical permit. So we can be very confident when we look at this and your better vendors will put in more details, which is going to help you because this is exactly what insurance companies and appraisal companies do when they're trying to verify that these items have actually been done on your home. And so when you have good vendors that pull good permits and put good notes, that just helps you down the road. Plus, when I go to when we sold this house, we were able to say, hey, all these items were all done in 2018. It was all permitted. It's all verified. You can go look it up and see for yourself. So it really helps you on the back end when you're trying to sell a property. If you think this real estate sheet might be helpful for you, or if you want to get have any other questions, please leave a comment below. Look in the description.